Hi, this is Tended De Design again. Today I'm going to do a quick striping tape tutorial. I got um, 10 rolls of striping tape like this one from Amazon. I think it was like only 28 cents, but it came somewhere, it came from somewhere in Asia, so it took a long time to get to my house, but it was definitely worth it because it was really inexpensive. So, um, I already put on two coats of Avon Sunshine. I don't know if you can see it. It's tiny writing at the top, but whatever. And then I put on one coat of Sally Hansen Dries Instantly. Because if you, like, don't let the base color dry quite enough and then put on tape and then rip the tape off, sometimes it will pull up your color. So if you put a coat of this on top or just a top coat and let it dry sufficiently, it um, should protect your base color from pulling up. So what I'm going to do is just show you like really quick just how to how you do this. I'm going to do horizontal stripes. I'll do it on my I'll do it on my ring or pointer finger first. So I'm just gonna apply the tape. And you can use tweezers to do this. I prefer just to use my fingers to put on the tape. I want to do five stripes. If I can fit that, I'll see how it goes. Yep, I'll be able to fit that. So, just line it up the way you want it push it down and I always also push my nail along the edges just to make sure it's secure because if you don't push it um, on the edges enough it can go the next color you put on can go underneath the tape and then it just doesn't look as good and after I put on this coat of polish, I'm going to take a nail art brush like I used in my other video and I'll dip it in some acetone to clean up around the edges just to make the manicure look nice and neat. Okay, so I'm going to be putting on CoverGirl um, out of the blue. Mm, oh, oops, on the back. <laughs> I don't know if you can see that, it's a tiny writing. Okay. Okay. So I'm just going to paint that on. Over top of the tape and my base color, obviously. I'm going to try to get right on the edges so you can't see the yellow. You can always clean up the edges with acetone or nail polish remover. So it's okay if you get a little on your skin. So the color's on and you're not supposed to let it dry or else it can crack the polish on top and just make it look bad. So I'm taking my tweezers and just pulling that off. And also if you do happen to mess up with a line and you get some polish underneath you can always take a nail art brush or a toothpick or a dotting tool and just go over that messed up spot like say I got too much blue underneath so it was going onto the yellow and it didn't look good. You can just clean that up with some more polish and People won't be able to notice. That's what I do if I mess it up. Ooh, I'm trying to get this off. Okay, so that's my final product, and I'm going to put um, top coat on too. I'm gonna do two, probably two coats of this, and that's all you have to do. It's pretty easy. Okay, I hope you this was at all helpful. And if you have any suggestions for tutorials, that would be great because I'm not sure what you guys want, because I've just started out and stuff. Okay. 
Thank you. Bye.